Welcome to hell. Hey, Steph. Whoa. Hey, Calamastia. Surprised to see me on parole? I told you Wells was out to get you. That text was a rare courtesy, by the way. I don't normally get involved in other people's dumb decisions. Thanks for trying, but skipping yesterday was totally worth it. Skipping with Rachel Amber does have an appeal. Well, yeah. So, what are you doing here? Uh, I figured I'd see the Tempest. For real? You? Yeah, I know. It's not really my thing. Uh, <laughs> kinda hoping it's a shit show. What the hell? I'm the stage manager. Oh, I think I knew that. My bad. You better mean it. Honestly, the show's really good. It's worth seeing. I'm sure it is. Obviously, Rachel's fantastic, but everyone else is pretty impressive, too. You get to see a totally different side of everyone, especially the guys. Okay. I'm intrigued. Go on. Like, Hayden's so annoying, but when he puts on that crown, he's actually very princely. And Nathan is Caliban? There's so much depth there. Right. Depth. Yeah, well, good luck with all of that. <laughs> Maybe I'll see you later. Oh, hey. I wanted to ask you something. Shoot. I've been planning to make a move on Rachel, but not if you two were together. Make a move? So, are you? Uh... I mean, that's Rachel's business. Or maybe yours and Rachel's business. But if you feel comfortable telling me... She's... single. You sure? That's what I said. I'll see you later, Steph. Have fun storming the castle. Locked. Figures. Looks like my options are become a master lock picker or swipe someone's keys. I'll see you at the Tempest, right? Why, yes. St What are you doing here? Aren't you supposed to be at home, thinking over your endless list of questionable decisions? Dude, why do you care about my questionable decisions? It offends me when intelligence is wasted. <laughs> Did Evan just call me intelligent? Damn straight. Wow. Evan looks... really ridiculous. Chloe? Uh-huh. I've learned something about myself recently. Something that I think you might understand. I've learned that if I'm passionate about something, it's probably the right thing to care about. For example, I've been trying to get the students and administration interested in forest fire prevention. That is kind of an odd topic to focus on. People are so eager to pass on responsibility to anyone else so that they can live comfortable, unworried, and ultimately meaningless lives. You see what happened? Evan, you're pretty stuck up. Did you know that? It's fine. The first sign of greatness is people disliking you. Anyway, you're not supposed to be here. You should leave.
Hey, Samuel. Keeping busy? Always, Chloe Price. I didn't think you'd be returning to these hallowed halls so soon. <laughs> Neither did I. I have the feeling it wasn't uh, the books or bricks of Blackwell that led you back. <laughs> what? You're here for someone. A special someone, yes? I've got to go, man. Uh, it's been real. Be kind to yourself, Chloe Price. Bingo. If only those keys were unsupervised. What's Samuel working on? Uh, the sprinklers? The prodigal girl returns. What shall we talk about? I've got to go, man. Uh, it's been real. Be kind to yourself, Chloe Price. If Samuel's working on the sprinklers, some damage here might get his attention. But Evan is right there. Hey! Shit. I wanted you to go the other way. Like, as far as possible, the other way. Time for a fresh start. Here we go. So tempting, but Evan will see me for... Gotcha. Oh, perfect. You're welcome. Awesome. Now I just have to wait for Samuel to turn on the... <laughs> that works. Sorry, Samuel. All right, time to find Drew's room. No time like the present. Skip, how's it going? Not that it isn't great to see you and all, but what are you doing here? Didn't you just get expelled? I'm on a secret drug-related mission, Skip. Under the authority of the Arcadia Bay District Attorney's Office. Really? No. Dude, I, I'm just visiting a friend. I, I can't... I really can't just let you go in. I'm going inside, dude. You're just gonna have to let this slide. 
I don't think I can. In fact, I think I have to ask you to state your official business or else vacate Blackwell property. I hate to do this to Skip, but I've got to get inside. Maybe if I make him really uncomfortable, he'll feel guilty and let me pass. What's my official business? Women's business, Skip. As in, my uterus? I need to use the restroom. Glad you asked. What? No. No, it's my job to ask, Chloe. Your job is creepy, then. Which makes you kind of a creeper. Oh, it's not like that. Do you know what Wells would do to me if I didn't, you know, patrol? Is Wells pressuring you to write more students up? I'm not even a student, but sure, don't let that stop you. I thought we were friends. Where is this coming from? I, I thought we were friends too, but... When the man comes down on you, you come down on me. Is that it? Look, look, look! I am really sorry, Chloe. I'm just so confused right now. You're... you're sorry? Y you just looked at my tits. You, you did! You stared right at them. Oh, shit. I, I don't know what to do. Seriously, my uterus is on fire, dude. What? Is that, uh, descriptive enough? I don't want to know, but... En fuego utero, Skip. En fuego utero. I don't, I don't know what to say. I'm so sorry. Matthews. <sighs> I'm here? I've gotten reports of an unknown vehicle in the parking lot. Thank God. Oh, I'm on it. I won't tell Wells. Do what you have to do, okay? I won't tell anyone. All right, which one is Drew's room? Elliot Hampton's room. Wonder what he's up to right now. Yep. Uh -huh. Definitely Drew's room. Good. <laughs> Drew's not here. Okay. <laughs> if I were Drew, where would I hide my money? <laughs> 